All right, guys, today we're making oil roti. Um, I got two cups of flour here. So I'll do four cups, all-purpose flour. I'm gonna try to use out all my flour that I have here. So I have another two cups of flour here. <clears throat> I used to spoon of this uh, bacon powder here. I'll mix up this bacon powder nicely in here make sure it's mixed up really good it depends on the flour that you use um, your roti will come out depends um, this will be nice and fluffy And I have a cup of water here. You can have some extra flour to side. You might need some more. You can add a little bit more water if you want. Not too much water, not too much flour. But you want you want the dough to be the right texture. <clears throat> it's a very easy recipe. Diana oil roti. And I got two main roti. Um, oil roti and um, Seiko roti, I think. Parata roti is the fine, the skinny roti. I think Parata roti is the thicker one that some people call Kyark wheel. I like nice skinny oil flaky flaky roti. If you follow the instruction and the way you mix it, you want to get this kind of loosey thing here. The dough to be nice and loosed up. And sometimes you're gonna use less water and more water. It's all up on you. How you mixing it and and the flour. And depends on where you at, which country flour it is. So I just used out most of my water there. So I need need to knead this up pretty good. I'll just add a little bit of flour 
here. That much. Want some more flour? Um, just a little bit more, not too much. So this is an important part: mixing it up here. You have to really mix this up real good so you can get that fluffy roti flaky into it. Don't scare to get your hand dirty. So you just want to roll it like this here. It is like that. So just fold it in. Keep on folding it. And you want to get this texture here a little nice and soft. See? There you go. Okay, so I roll this out a little bit here and I'll start making this out and oiling it up. about six roti from this here. This one, two, three, four, five, six roti here. <clears throat> and I got some olive oil here that you're gonna need. You can either use one of this brush here, your hand, or paper towel. flour here. And of course the rolling pin. I think I made this one here a little too small. I made this one small for my son actually. He like a little nice small roti. I just want to put a little bit of flour in here. You want to give it a cut here, or some people use their finger. And you just want to roll it in. 
can then take it and tie it up in here nice like that and take this and press it down in there so that's what's make the roti when you fold the roti up good so we're gonna try another one here You don't have to um, get this wrong right now, but is he gonna oil it? So you want the roti soak in the oil. So give it a cut like that. Everybody got their own way in folding the roti. This is my way. And tie the roti up in here. So that's one roti right there. Another one, two. Guys, I love oil roti, dal and roti. One of my favorite dish right there. Oil and roti or a fried egg. Don't shame to make your roti. And there you go. So guys, uh, put these roti here to soak for 20, 25 minutes. You can do it for half an hour. Um, soak your roti pretty good. You want that oil to soak in in that roti. So guys, I got six roti here. I cover it up. Um, I'll leave it, I cover it with a wet paper towel. I'll leave it there for I would say 25 minutes, 20, depends. And um, then I'll start start to roll it out back. <coughs> Just roll it up in here and put it on the towel. Hey guys, so out of the six roti, I did one of them already and I got another one going here. And So 
So today we're lashing, we're eating some oil roti, bora and potatoes with dry fish and shrimp in the long beans. Slash bora. Half of it finished up already, but look. Is that here? Is that? I would just need to clap it. We already got one done. Okay. I like my roti a little brown, crispy. Me too. So. Okay. So we just put another one on there. Okay, you're gonna clap the roti for the camera. You're gonna clap the roti for the camera. Oh yeah, I gotta clap the roti, no? Yeah, for the camera. That's a nice roti, guys, look. You clap roti better than women. Mm -hmm. Look at that. It's nice. Good nice. job. So, uh -huh. Excuse the camera, but there it is. Let's turn it. Okay, I need to leave you turn that. Yeah, I gotta turn that one there. So this is a cast iron skillet I'm using. It's kinda different from the fry pan. It cooks different too. Um, yeah, it's cook. It carry a lot of heat in it. I should have used my fry pan and cook inside or the towel. Is it fine? It's fine, everyone. Mm -hmm. I'm born in love with the emerald tea. Guys, the roti come out pretty good. Look, look at that. I'm not the best roti maker, but she comes out pretty good, right, babe? Yeah. I love that one. How it burns up mm, there a little bit. Yummy, mm. yummy. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Yeah, of course it's soft. Oh, man. Nothing like, nothing like finishing work and come home <laughs> to your husband making roti and bora, a bit. Mm -hmm. That's 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 awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like this thing, guys. This this um, thing here is brand new. I had losing that black mark there, um, dust, whatever, but. I guess it's okay. It's okay. It's still gonna taste good. Yeah. It's brand new. You just gotta break it in. Yeah. It's the American version of a tower. Uh huh. Yep. But they, they use it to do veggies and stuff. Okay. Like that. Lots of veggies. I see. And we take it and do roti. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess cooking in it a few times is gonna break in, right? Of course. We just gotta get uh, track the heating in it. 
Clap it, babe. Clap it. Clap it. Oh, look, look at the roots. Nice and flaky, guys. See? Looks fiery. Mm, yummy. Mm -hmm. Yum, yum. Let's put another one on this, this towel here. We got one last one, right? Yeah. One last one to go. So this is a little tiny one. We usually make sugar roti with the small one right there. Oh my god, I haven't had sugar roti in forever. Yeah. My mom used to make that a lot. Yeah, we should have made a little sugar roti. I think it's this really good, you know. Uh -huh. And the last you had one. But I'm too sweet, I don't need any more sugar. I'm, just, mm -hmm. I'm sweet as I mm -hmm. am. Right, babe? Mm -hmm. So guys, if you didn't subscribe to the channel, please do so. Hit that like button at the bottom. Make a comment down in the corner over there. <laughs> and hit that the other video on the top here. Absolutely. All right? Yeah. Make sure you subscribe. This is Vish making oil roads. And the boar and smoked fish and potato um, is already online. You guys can watch that if you want the recipe. It tastes amazing, guys. Usually on the other tower, you put it ha um, halfway mm -hmm. down. Heat. Okay. Um, but this uh, we we gotta practice with this guy here with this and see how it goes. Oh, it's amazing. Yeah. Usually my roti usually lays up pretty good, man. I don't know why. I think this, this is the um this thing. Is this gas iron yeah. skillet? But guess what? It cook it really good. Look at those over there. Yeah. It's nice and flaky, huh? Yeah, it is. Yum, yum. Check this out, guys. Yum, yum. Look at this one here again. Nice and flaky. Look. See? Take her shape. Look at that. Look. I think it'd be them roti then, man. Eh? Nice roti, man. Babe, who make the best roti? You do. Actually, you make the best everything. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm your biggest cheerleader, so. Yeah. You know how that is. I love you for that. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> she bubbled in there. Kind of bubbling session. Bay later roti. Mm -hmm. I put a lot of flour. Okay. And that's what's burning up in the towel here. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. 
no big deal. A lot of the roti you've made in the past was popping, but when you didn't cook it on this thing, yeah, and it's swollen really big. Mm -hmm. So, well, we never put it on camera. Yeah. So Actually, I I got a couple on camera oh, you do? on okay. Facebook. Oh, but not on that channel. This one here is pretty good. I like the roti a little boring like that. Me Crispy, too, me you too. Know? Yeah, man. Even sad roti, and mm -hmm. I really love it crispy too. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I like it myself. Alright, guys, this is that here. And let's check this one here. Yep. And it's very, very soft. It's very, very soft. This roti is soft and nice and flaky. Look at it. You can peel it and eat it. No joke about it. No doubt about it. It's, it smells amazing. Just like back in the Caribbean, in Guyana. Um, this one here is straight from India. The oil roti. Look, look at that. It's straight from India. Mm -hmm. um, nice and flaky. Look at that. Yawan roti. Got roti there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here, take the first bite. Alright, thank you guys for watching. We really appreciate everyone that watching the video. One love and peace out. Adios. Yeah, let's show the roti.